Hi there, this is a quick video to walk you through Evernote's improved web clipper, specifically for Gmail. There are a number of ways to email your notes into Evernote. I've probably covered that here on the blog before, and depending on your email client, you likely have your favorite system in place. If you're a Gmail user like myself, then uh, this improvement is definitely a time saver, and uh, I'll just take a moment to walk you through it now. Here in Gmail, I've received a promo email from the cottages of Clear Lake. I like to keep this in Evernote, so moving up just to the right of the address bar, you'll find the clipper. I'm going to clip it to Evernote. Right now, it's uh, using the title of the email, which is fine in this case. I can change it. And the notebook it's choosing is my default inbox, and clicking on this arrow here will open a whole bunch of other options. Uh, we can add tags such as vacation and family and any other number of tags that you might want to use and of course you can add comments. I'm going to skip that right now and we'll save the email. It's done its job. It's showing me a few related notes. That's great. I'll close that. I could continue browsing or checking email but for right now, let's bump back over to Evernote. We'll quickly sync. And here is that email. Um, it's done a pretty good job of capturing all the HTML. And beneath that, of course, given that I'm a premium user, you'll see some related notes. Many times, the email that you want to capture and save to Evernote is a threaded conversation. It's important then to click the Expand All button above the date in order to capture everything once you select the Clip button. And that's it.